everyone. This is Julie at Hawaiian Beach Walk. I hope you're having a great day. Well, Santa's shop has been open for a while now and getting things all ready. And I wanted to just share with you a really fast, quick gift that I thought um, I'm going to be using for some of my friends or people in the office. Um, I thought this was just a really cute gift. So basically, it's called the uh, hand sanitizers um, because we make these to look like Santa's. <laughs> And his outfit. So what I did is, um, now this particular bottle that I'm using is from a Melaleuca uh, hand sanitizer, but any sanitizer that you have, just make a measurement from the top of the bottle and th to the bottom, and that will tell you how wide you need to make this piece. Mine is two and a half inches. And then um, I just took a ruler and just kind of measured it around and I made mine to be six inches long. Okay, so that's how I did mine. And then what I had done here is um, I basically took the piece of paper before I had this all attached and I just kind of made it go around the bottle so I could kind of figure out, okay, where is the front? You know, and so as you'll see when I put it on the bottle, you see there's kind of like little marks on the paper. So that helped me to tell me, okay, this is the center. Then I made this piece, this white piece is um, a half inch and I made it by two and a half since the red is also two and a half. Then I took black cardstock and I made this six inches long and I it is a quarter inch wide. I had some gold that is also a quarter inch and I, so I just made it a quarter inch by quarter inch and cut that for the belt. And so really it's very simple. All I did is I put double-sided tape on each end, all right? And so when you put it around like this, one will stick to the bottle and then the other one will close. So like this one will stick to the bottle and this one will close like this, okay? Just like so. So that's what I did and that's how I got this. Then all I did after that is I just added this ho, ho, ho. Now, okay, I save everything. <laughs> I save all my scraps. So this was originally a half inch piece of white that I had for my scrap pile. So I just cut it in half so it's a quarter inch. And then I was like, well, okay, let's see um, how long I wanted to make it. So I made it about like this. I think it's this piece that I have on here is about um, an inch and five eighths if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so I just cut it like that. Okay. And um, I make the flagging on each side, on each end. So snip in the middle, and then from corner to the center, and then from corner to the center, and there you go. And so I do the same thing on the other side. And this might be a little too long. We might shorten it, but that's okay. It all, it's all good. All right, and then I take the um, Project Life Actually, it's not a Project Life pin now. There are journal pins um, and that you can get through Stampin' Up. And I just handwrite on here. And so I'm just putting ho, ho, ho. And okay, there we go. Now, as I said, this piece might be a little long, and I think it is. I think there's, there's too much space here on the end, so not a problem. You just cut it a little bit, snip that off, and redo the end not an issue. And there you go. We fixed it. <laughs> I always tell when we're doing um, with my craft classes or uh, with our Cards of Faith ministry, I'm like, oh, there's nothing we can't fix. There's always a fix. Somehow, some way we can fix it. So then all I'm going to do is I'm gonna, just going to put this on at like so. And I'm going to use glue dots. Okay. Glue dots are really great when it comes to just those quick attachments that you need. And um, if you have like a, sometimes like a small, where you don't have a lot um, to be able to adhere to, like you can't use a dimensional because it's, you know, the piece is too small. You can also roll your glue dots a little bit up to make them thinner. And then I'm just gonna go like that. And there we go. Now, and then I will attach it to the bottle. 
and the project will be done. And I have another one ready to be able to give as a gift. So I just wanted to share this with you because like I said, it's a fast gift and it's something that uh, you can make for men and women and just say Merry Christmas. And I, I hope you enjoy it and use up all those scraps so that you might have so you can make sure that it all goes to good use. All right, well anyways, uh, we will be doing more videos as we're getting closer to Christmas. I know we're all busy and trying to make those gifts with those special touches. And I will be doing some more videos to be able to share some more ideas with you. All right, well, you have a great day, and I will be talking to you soon. Aloha. Hey.